grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the communion of the Holy Spirit be with you all. And also with you. Let us pray. All-powerful and unseen God, the coming of your light into our world has brightened weary hearts with peace. Call us out of darkness and empower us to proclaim the birth of your Son, Jesus Christ, our Savior and Lord, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. Amen. The Holy Gospel according to Luke, the second chapter. Glory to you, O Lord. In those days, a decree went out from Emperor Augustus that all the world should be registered. This was the first registration and was taken while Quirinius was the governor of Syria. All went to their own towns to be registered. Joseph also went from the town of Nazareth in Galilee to Judea, to the city of David called Bethlehem, because he was descended from the house and family of David. He went to be registered with Mary, to whom he was engaged and who was expecting a child. While they were there, the time came for her to deliver the child, and she gave birth to her firstborn son and wrapped him in bands of cloth and laid him in a manger because there was no place for them at an inn. In that region, there were shepherds living in the fields, keeping, keeping watch over their flock by night. Then an angel of the Lord stood before them, and the glory of the Lord shone around them, and they were terrified. But the angel said to them, Do not be afraid, for see, I am bringing you good news of great joy for all the people. To you is born this day in the city of David a Savior, who is the Messiah, the Lord. This will be a sign for you. You will find a child wrapped in bands of cloth and lying in a manger. And suddenly there was the, with the angel a multitude of heavenly hosts praising God and saying, Glory to God in the highest heaven and on peace among those whom he favors. When the angels had left them and gone into heaven, the shepherds and said to one another, Let us go now to Bethlehem and see this thing that has taken place, which the Lord has made known to us. So they went with haste and found Mary and Joseph and the child lying in the manger. And when they saw this, they made known what had been told them about this child. And all who heard it were amazed at what the shepherds told them. But Mary treasured all these words and pondered them in her heart. The shepherds returned, glorifying and praising God for all they had heard and seen as it had been told to them. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, O Christ.
joining our voices with the heavenly host and Christians throughout time and space, let us pray for the church, the world, and all in need. Your spirit calls your church to rejoice in Christ's birth. As we gather at the manger, help us see your face in all babies needing comfort and care. Equip the church in the nurture and encouragement of all children. Merciful God, receive, receive our, our prayer. prayer. The rocks and streams proclaim your praise. Attune us to the joyful sounds and groaning of your creation. Stir us to tend the earth wisely, that the whole earth may dwell in abundance and peace. Merciful God, receive, receive our, our prayer. prayer. Your messengers declare your joy to the world. Embolden leaders and nations to make your justice and peace known throughout the earth. Uphold justice advocates and social service providers who risk their safety to help others. Merciful God, receive, receive our, our prayer. prayer. You choose those regarded as lowly to tell the good news of your love. Pour out your mercy and care on all who are sick, grieving, struggling, and the elderly who live alone. Merciful God, receive, receive our, our prayer. prayer. You abide with your people in times of trouble. Accompany families and children who have nowhere to turn. Strengthen this congregation and local ministries in their care for those fleeing danger, abuse, or neglect. Merciful God, receive, receive our, our prayer. prayer. Your grace and mercy extend to all. Give comfort to those who mourn and assure them of the peace you have granted those who have gone before us. Merciful God, receive, receive our, our prayer. prayer. Rejoicing in your word made flesh among us, we commend these prayers to you, confident of your grace and love made known to us in Jesus Christ, our Savior. Amen. Amen. Gathered into one by the Holy Spirit, let us pray as Jesus taught us. Our, our Father, Father, who, who art, art in heaven, heaven, hallowed be thy name. name. Thy, thy kingdom come, thy, thy will be done. done on, on earth as it is in heaven. heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. Friends, on this Christmas day, may the Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord's face shine on you with grace and mercy. The Lord look upon you with favor and give you peace. Amen. <laughs>